there, Mrs. Dixon here. Today, I would love to read you a story. It's called Sky Color. This is written by Peter Reynolds. If you remember, in library, we read the story, The Dot. This is the same author, and he has a pretty cool story that I want to share with you today. Marisol was an artist, and she loved to draw. And she even had her very own art gallery. Look at that. Do you have one of those at your house? My refrigerator doesn't have quite so many, but it does have some artwork on it. Now, not all of her art hung in a gallery. Much of it she shared with the world. She painted posters to share ideas she believed in. And at school, Marisol was famous for her creative clothes her box of art supplies, and her belief that everyone was an artist. And there's her making her posters. Yes, Marisol was an artist through and through. So when her teacher told the class they were going to paint a mural for the library, Marisol couldn't wait to begin. Can you imagine coming to the library and painting all over the wall? I can't imagine that. <laughs> the classroom buzzed with the sound of brainstorming. The students talked and sketched, and together they made a great big drawing. See it on here? Then they marched to the library. I'll paint a fish. I'll paint one too. I'll paint the ocean. And Marisol shouted, I'll paint the sky. Hmm, how would you paint the sky? So Marisol rummaged through her box of paint, but could not find any blue. How am I going to paint the sky without blue paint? Because that's what the sky is, right? Blue? Well, the bell rang and it was time to put their brushes down for the day. And as she claimed aboard the bus, Marisol kept wondering. Hmm. All the way home, she stared out the window. What do you see? The sun lowered to the horizon. Look at the sky now. It's not blue, is it? Later at home, Marisol watched as the day turned into night. Look at all those colors in the sky. That night, Marisol settled down into a deep dream. She drifted through a sky swirling with colors. The colors mixed, making them too many to count. Look at all of those colors in her dream. In the morning, Marisol stood waiting for the bus in the rain. The sky was not blue, and she smiled. I wonder why she smiled. At school, Marisol raced to the library. She grabbed a dish and began adding colors. This one, that one, she swirled the brush to make an altogether new color. Marisol began to paint on the wall, and a boy asked, what color is that? That, Marisol said, that is sky color. Look at this picture, how they did it and how her sky kind of put all the colors that she saw throughout the day. Not just blue, because she didn't have blue paint, but as the sun was setting, it had the different colors and it was setting deeper. You got the purples and the different colors. Pretty creative. I like and that's the end of the story and that's the book called sky color. I hope that you enjoyed our story today